the Santa Blanca Security Forces. Runba El Muro, childhood friend and personal bodyguard to El Sueño. El Muro means the wall, as in no one gets over it, no one gets under it, no one gets around it. SBC security forces recruit hard and train harder. Instructors from Israel, South Africa, Russia, and unfortunately, even the good old US of A. Polygraphs, first of every month. Pass, you pick up your paycheck. Fail? Yeah, don't fail. Even so, El Muro has a polygraph system of his own. These Sicarios, aka gunmen, get intense training in marksmanship, surveillance, driving. Two-thirds wash out to become... Halcones. The guys who make it get assigned to various regions as enforcers, guards for labs and shipments, hitmen. Some become drivers, surveillance specialists, spies, and torturers. Just below El Muro is Santa Blanca's head Sicario, La Plaga, the plague. You may ask, how does a show-off party boy rise to be the second in command of Santa Blanca security? Answer, sperm. La Plaga is El Muro's little brother, but don't kid yourselves. He's the nastiest motherfucker on the internet, and yes, I have been on 4chan. Don't worry, you'll see what I'm talking about. Francisco Ricardo Munguia, El Muro, The Wall, The Wall Between Me and My Enemies, The Wall Between Me and Death. We were born hours apart in the same village. As boys we were as poor as the rats that scrambled across our dirt floor. Our huts in the shadows of the hilltop mansions, where the narco bosses lived like conquerors. El Muro took a different path. He joined the army. Special forces. He rose through the ranks, helped to protect the local narcos, was paid in cocaine and money along with promotions. When we met again, Francisco hermano, why are you still in the army? You and me together, we could rule. We will protect each other as we did when we were boys. We will share like brothers. Ignacio Perez Cervantes, also known as La Plaga, the Plague. Head of security for Santa Blanca, and the little brother of El Muro. El Muro had him trained well. Paid off guys in Russia's Bodark Special Forces group to teach him combat tactics. Sent him to learn killing techniques from death squads in El Salvador and Honduras. Apparently, he was a good student. His favorite subject? Cutting off a person's face, then showing it to them. Back in the day, it used to be that the criminals hid, and the good guys tried to find them. But La Plaga, he does everything he possibly can to be seen. The guy is a social media machine. He pays narco corrido bands to write songs about him. He has his own personal camera crew. This fuck even has his own YouTube channel. La Plaga is a walking recruitment message. Young people see what he has and want it. The guys want to join him. The girls want to get wifed up. It'd almost be funny to see a guy who spends three hours a day sending dick pics. Except half of what he posts aren't messages to his followers, but messages to his enemies. There's only one way to stop the plague from spreading. You cut it off from society, then watch it die out. <laughs> 